birthday, America, and hello, everyone. I'm Mia Toski, and you're watching Fresh Outlook. Wherever you are in the Benke, Dr. Alan Sanders from St. Peter's University, and we are also proud to welcome Admiral Robert O'Ray. He is the CEO of Blue Star Veterans Network. Thank you so much, and a first-timer to Fresh Outlook, so thank you for being here. Well, Admiral, uh, you have just left the Navy, we understand, and you're now the CEO of this wonderful network that we want to talk about. But for you, uh, who spent so much time in the military, what does it mean to you to be an American? I was in Boston Common yesterday talking with a young man from Moldova who was in the United States for the first time ever. And it made me realize that the more I travel around the world and the more I read and the more I talk to non-Americans, the more I realize that we are the most blessed people in the history of the planet and that sometimes we forget that and the more you study the rest of the world the more you, you realize that we really are lucky and i couldn't agree with you more well, maybe but not rejects <laughs> if you go to australia you might be able to say they've got the uh... <laughs> yeah yeah that was a penal colony uh, yeah it, very my it just say. wasn't the place to go though because it was such a uh, barren and wild and unpredictable place so it really took some great courage to come but here but the incredible number for me is 2.5 million yeah. That's the population of Denver today. <laughs> so imagine taking the population of Denver and sprinkling it from Maine all the way down to Georgia within 50 or 100 miles of the coast. And they got together right. and decided to overthrow the most powerful nation in, in the world at the time. It's just phenomenal. It, it, it was a, a bloody and long.